dystopian times. Here's what I want to do. Every single week on this program, I really want to take the time to use my platform to uh, showcase another creator, uh, sometimes smaller, sometimes pretty big. But basically, I want to make sure that there's solidarity in this movement. And the way that the right like kind of cross pollinates and speaks with each other and promotes each other, I want to try to facilitate that. And so this week, I have a creator that I want to feature that uh, I just found out about recently. Uh, his content is incredibly entertaining. He's very sharp. Uh, I am going to uh, now showcase his uh, his video where he makes his uh, case, and um, let's uh, let's take a look. All right, so first off, I just want to give a huge thank you to Mike for giving me the platform to shamelessly promote my own content. I think that if leftist media is going to seriously compete with corporate giants, then we're going to need to be constantly engaging in acts of solidarity within each other's communities so that we can effectively build this as a collective project. But with that being said, hi, my name is Mac. I go by Good Politic Guy, mainly on Twitter and YouTube for now, but also soon to be on Twitch where I'm going to be doing weekend live streams where I game and rant about politics with you guys. But for now, you can find me on my YouTube channel where I upload every single weekday, multiple times times a day where I'm basically just covering the current events, the breaking news of that day from an anti-imperialist and an anti-capitalist perspective. So on any given day, we could be talking about everything from AOC and the squad strategies that they are deploying or failing to deploy in Congress to CIA attempts to infiltrate and overthrow governments in South and Central America to even UFO stories occasionally and really everything in between. Now, the reasons I originally got into political commentary in the first place are really twofold. One, because I didn't want to keep bombarding my friends and family with my endless frustrations with American politics, and so I figured, why not upload these takes online and bother you guys with them instead? And two, because I believe that corporate media is indistinguishable from state media when corporations control the state. And what I mean by that is, in the United States, our free press, or supposed free press, is utterly failing to do their job of accurately and adequately informing the American people by holding the government accountable and being that check that in a functioning democracy a free press would provide. And with the mainstream media outlets preferring to cozy up to the establishments of the Republican and Democratic parties, I think there's a serious lack of voices out there that are willing to call out the endless militarism, the endless corruption, and preference for the status quo that even the supposed left half of our corporate duopoly is preserving. Well, I thank you for your question, uh, but I have to say we're capitalist, and that's just the way it is. <laughs> And unlike these corporate outlets that pretend to be some perfectly neutral arbiters of truth as they are actually limiting the scope of debate within the confines of whatever their government agency friends or corporate overlords deem is acceptable, I do not hide my own biases. And so I try to give upfront, clear, honest, and concise analyses with the intention of informing people as to the destructive nature of our global capitalist system, as well as how we can move towards a more sustainable, free, and democratic society. So if any of that seems like it would be appealing to you, then go ahead and check me out at youtube.com slash goodpolitics guy and i appreciate the support everyone there's going to be links in the description box please go subscribe to him so he is about to hit six thousand subs um i think we can get him to 10k by the end of uh july i, I think that that's certainly possible and hey if you are starting out it's really hard nowadays to get your foot in the door but here's what you can do you can email me mike at humanistreport.com and uh i want you in the uh the uh the subject line Put in DT, Dystopian Times, underscore, submission, in all caps, and then colon, and then your name. And so I'm anticipating a lot of submissions. I can only do one per week. But um, having said that, though, if you record a two to three minute video, uh, provide me with your links. Uh, I will uh, look into featuring you on this program because I want to make sure that we are helping uh, other folks who are just starting out. And by the way, Mac will be on the panel next week so if you discover his content and you like him he's going to be on dystopian times with some really fantastic guests so far i have confirmed isaiah james who's running for congress uh lance from the surfs and david dole now there's some other people that i'm speaking with so you know the panel might be bigger than that having said that though please 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 consider uh, supporting smaller channels